हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम अरमोगान एंड यू आर वाचिंग निंजा इराकी दिनार यूट्यूब चैनल होपफुली यू ऑल डूइंग वेल गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस फॉर यू ऑल आई ट्राई माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू ऑल लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिनार सो गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे द इंफॉर्मेशन अकॉर्डिंग टू माय सीबीआई कांटेक्ट Ali Alalak's resignation has not yet been accepted, making it unofficial for now. The media might have jumped the gun with the story, so it's best to wait and see how things unfold for Mr. Alalak. If he stays on, he'll need to cooperate with the US Treasury and work out a suitable plan, which he'll then present to the Finance Committee. He's also scheduled to visit the US soon to discuss this matter further. There's some speculation about who the new CBI governor might be. with rumors suggesting that the US Treasury is playing a key role in this decision. However, it appears that the CBI governor is more of a figurehead with no real decision-making power or authority to vote on anything. Instead, the governor's role is primarily to make announcements to the international community and the Iraqi citizens and to report to the prime minister. Now, imagine seeing a currency regain its former peak value what opportunities that could create. Today, we're delving into a topic that's creating quite a buzz, the Iraqi dinar and the hopes many have for its revival. Some believe that this could actually happen, so stay tuned as we explore the claims, the key players involved, and what this might mean for investors like you. Currently, the Iraqi dinar is trading far below its historical highs from the 1980s, but some insiders think that the CBI contact is planning for a shift. They believe he will continue as a proxy director for a while, providing some much needed stability during these uncertain times. Reports suggest that this CBI contact is motivated by the country's best interests, proposing policies that could help restore the dinar's value to those desirable 1980s levels. And as investors, isn't that exactly what we're hoping for? Being a proxy director typically means the current director might not hold a permanent position. but they still have enough influence to shape policies this can create a sense of continuity providing investors with some confidence if the policies are guided by a stable hand reviving the iraqi dinar to its historical levels could potentially attract both local and foreign investments leading to a surge in economic growth in the region key policies under discussion include enhancing banking regulations to boost investor confidence and forming international trade agreements that could stimulate economic activity these agreements might incentivize countries to engage in trade with iraq however it's important to question whether this scenario is too optimistic Critics argue that these plans may lack a strong foundation as economic recovery is often slow and accompanied by numerous challenges with political stability being a crucial factor despite these concerns there's a hopeful outlook investors are always on the lookout for opportunities and the possibility of the dinar's revival presents a unique chance reflecting on history Periods of economic instability in Iraq have eventually led to significant recoveries, mirroring patterns seen in other countries after events like the Great Recession, where some currencies rebounded and economies recovered. So, is it realistic to think this can happen in Iraq? Many believe it is. For these investors, the prospect of the dinar regaining its former value is more than just wishful thinking. It offers hope, a reason to invest, and a chance to recover lost ground. When considering the opinions expressed in forums and discussions, you'll find a mix of strong optimism and cautious skepticism. Some view the potential gains from the dinar as life-changing, while others call for more concrete evidence and a detailed plan. Moving forward, it's crucial to stay informed and connected with reliable updates, particularly from the Central Bank of Iraq and economic experts. As always, make sure to invest wisely and thoroughly research any market before making decisions. What are your thoughts on the future of the Iraqi dinar? Share them in the comments below and join the conversation. Your insights are important. As we conclude, let's consider the key points we discussed today. The potential for the Iraqi dinar to regain its former value is both thrilling and intricate. By understanding the key players and their possible influence, we can better navigate this investment landscape. Keep your curiosity alive. Continue your research, and if you found this video engaging, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Share it with friends who might be interested, and be sure to subscribe for more in-depth explorations of investment opportunities and economic trends. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.